Okay, guys. In this instructional Humpty Dumpty Tribe trailer improvement video, I am going to teach you how to lay down a perfectly nice looking floor for, I would say, half the price of flooring. Cut your materials price in half and cut your labor by 90 percent particularly if you're dealing with a fucking 43 year old single wide trailer <coughs> at the end of a dirt road in a swamp in florida it's not a fucking five hundred thousand dollar house it's not mar-a-lago okay do we get it so <coughs> you have two choices here is our brand new kitchen floor. This is done the right way. This is done the right way. This is three men working, and it, I would say you have three men working eight hours, cussing, bitching, doing all of this fucking cutting, hammering, measuring, all of this shit, okay, to do it right, you have all of your fucking tools, good fucking God, you're, you're paying these guys uh, all of this goddamn money, uh, blah, 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 but you do it right, and you do come out with a, a, a you know, a nice looking kitchen floor. So this is our kitchen floor, and the trailer from hell, give us a big hand. All right, that is how you do it right. Now what we're going to do is we're going to tell you how to do it the ham bone way. Now this isn't going to quite work because the rug is not the rug is not wide enough but here is what you do this floor took three men eight hours this floor took let me get another light a little better lighting so you have that floor taking uh, three men, eight hours, or you have this floor taking one man about 15 minutes. It's every bit as beautiful as the other floor. 15 minutes, one person working, you cut your materials bill in half. Here's what you do. Now, I think these various kinds of flooring what this is called is the Traffic Master. This is the Home Depot brand, which is 36 inches, three feet. I think some of them are longer than three feet. So you probably want to get a brand that you get as long as you can, the planks as long as you can. But we were working with three feet. So uh, what you do to install this floor uh, one person working, you need no tools. No tools whatsoever. No tools. Okay? You need one person with two hands and one-fourth of a brain. What you do is this, guys. You measure the width of your room. Now, the width of this room is 14 feet, uh, unfortunately. But what you do is you measure the width of your room across the narrow side. So, uh, if your room measures 14 feet, what you're going to do is you're going to go down one wall, going bing, 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 laying this shit down. There is no piecing. There is no fitting. There's no seams. You start from one wall. Well, you need to leave a quarter inch for it to expand. You go down one wall, which brings you in three feet. 
Then you go over to the other wall. Now, my I was six inches shy here. But what you do is you take your three foot planks in our case, or hopefully longer planks, and you go up against this wall, well, a quarter inch from the wall, and you go down this line of the room, just like this line of the room. And what you have is the, this beautiful floor that one person can do in 15 fucking minutes with no tools whatsoever. You come out three feet here and three feet there, three plus three is six. So what you have to do is go on Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace and you have to find a rug. 14 minus six is eight. You need to find an eight foot wide rug and I didn't quite make it. This is a seven foot wide rug, god damn it. Uh, if this were an eight foot wide rug, this would line would look just like this line. You lay out your boards and they come out three feet from the fucking wall and you put your rug over it. Now, of course, the other thing is the, the length of the rug uh, is going to be, obviously, you want it to uh, fill up as much of the length where you just have. So you might be left with having to, you, you know, to do it the right way. And then you, ha then you might have things like uh, heater vents and stuff. So you might have to, you, you, you know, do a little bit on each end of the rug. Are you following me? Uh, do a little bit on the end of each rug. But you should be able to get your rug where hopefully you're not going to have to do more than one line uh, across two at the max. These are six inches wide. So if your room is, say you got a 12 foot by 12 foot room. Okay, 12 foot by 12 foot room. Uh, pretty easy. You come in three feet from either side. You go all the goddamn way down. All right. And then you have six feet of bare floor in the middle, so you need to get a six foot, six to seven foot wide rug. And then you need to get a, uh, well, if you get a 10 foot rug, then uh, what you would need, you would need to do, if you're using six inch wide planks, you would need to do two planks along that side and two planks along the back side, you, you, you know, do it the right way. But uh, there you go. Here is the hem bone, uh, single wide trailer rug special. Uh, this, see, this room, let's see, the, the rug was $15. And this is about four times 3,500, 800. So $150. So for $150, I have done the living room with no labor, zero price for tools, zero for tools, zero for labor. Hopefully, you can score you a nice $15 rug on Craigslist. You might have to go a little higher. So uh, this is a 14 by 18 foot room. You should be able to do by yourself, one person, a 14 by 18 foot room, even if you're working in a beat up old trailer, should cost you 
under $150 and should take you about an hour. About one hour of work and $150, you can have a perfectly fine looking uh, floor uh, in, in, in your trailer. This is trailer living. Or you can go out and with the, the labor, the tools, everything, uh, you can spend $150 doing it or you can spend $500 doing it. it, it it's your choice. But uh, as nice as this kitchen floor looks, I'm pretty damn proud of my, uh, of my 15 minute living room floor. Don't ever say you never hear anything on Humpty Dumpty Tribe. You never learn, you never, you know, hear something that you can't use. I'm trying to save you guys some serious money, some serious time, money, energy, heartache, possibly a heart attack and a stroke, or maybe a murder. Don't say I never did nothing for you. Bye, guys.